Hey guys, so like always, I know it's kind of been a while since I've done any uh, actual proper anime collectible review for a while, but um, but just a little while ago today I was at a Comic Con where I was able to get a couple more, and this time I was able to get the collectibles for Rorakia and Ida from My Hero Academia. Yeah, I mean, I'm really glad to be getting more characters from My Hero Academia because I haven't gotten one ever since I passed on back in August, I think it was, and now I'm back with being able to get more of them. And I actually did buy a Todoroki one, but when it came, it was kind of damaged, kind of, so I got a refund for it, so hopefully I'll be able to get another one really soon. But for now, I just want to talk about the new Uraraka and Ida ones I have here. So, yeah, so without further ado, let's just get into it. And so, the first one I want to do is my new Uraraka one, and here she is. So, yeah, really, I'm a simple uh, figure with this one, like, there's not, like, they have, unlike a lot of the other ones I have, this is all kind of just one figure, like, you can take a lot off the stand, but everything else is just all attached to her, unlike every other figure I've gotten, so, <clears throat> so, yeah, really, like, I've uh, well, finally gotten another, uh, My Hero Academia figure for after a while, and, yeah, this one is really great. So, yeah, you can tell from the joke and all that that they did a good job on her face and her cheeks and all that and her hair and all that. So, yeah, all that is really good, and, yeah, the joke and of every thing is really good, and, yeah, they got her costume down really good with the armband and all the the big food he has. So, yeah, really like who have gotten her, and, yeah, it, who have having uh, her alongside yet who and hot John in the tape back there, and, yeah, I just really like being a, and, yeah, I really like who are rock guys at Harris there, so just being able to get one of her is really cool. And, yeah, there's not, like, that much to her in terms of just how she's, like, standing, like, how she posing, she's just kind of standing there with her face clenched. Um, there are some other ones I have, uh, some other Ben Presto figures of her out there, but this was the one I just got because it was just easier to get this one. And, um, and yeah, it was just really nice to be able to find one of her and just, and yeah, just be really satisfied with the way it all looks. And it does look really good. So, yeah, really glad to have gotten her and I'm looking forward to seeing what she looks like in the case with the two of them. So, now, let's go yeah, back to a rock. Yeah, now we're moving on to Ida. And so, she, uh, uh, a little careful with this one, uh, here he is. So, yeah, this is the one for Ida. Yeah, a lot more detail on this one because, yeah, there's a lot of things on, like, his, uh, costume and all that. But, yeah, this one, again, is really cool. Yeah, just with a pose he's made, and, yeah, he's clearly using, like, his quirk and all that. And, yeah, again, um, because there's always so much the hail on his armor and all that, there's a lot of the hail on here. But yeah, you can tell there's a lot of good detail on this one, like the, um, like the way his armor all look. And yeah, if there's a little gap there, yeah, it's kind of hard at hack in like his upper body to like his legs and all that. But aside from that, if I do really like this one, and yeah, we, we didn't tell me they did a lot of detail, like with, with all the different parts on his armor and all that. And yeah, his face is really good too, with uh, just his usual look and also his glasses and everything like that. And yeah, we don't, there's no like helmet or anything like that, but that's fine with me because the rest of it does look really good. And yeah, I like, I really just like every 
when I'm there, why not you just work to a win? Yeah, because, why not? Yeah, because there was already so much on him, but just mean for a lot of opportunity to add a lot of things on to him, and I think they did a really good job. And I like the pose he's doing with the way he's always running, uh, yeah, the way he's always running like this, and yeah, I just really like that he does have a lot of cool things on it, and just his face, and just be his outfit overall does look really awesome, so yeah, having, and yeah, just finally being able to get more of Class 1A from my hero like Jamie was really cool, and so yeah, really like to have gotten him in Aura, yeah, so yeah, that's him, so, and that's really pretty good that, um, that the two I got recently were them, because recently I actually went, I actually went to see the new My Hero Academia like Jamie a movie in the cinema. It was really, yeah, I really liked it, and yeah, it was just really nice to be able to get them, um, just some time after I seen it, and yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad I did. Yeah. So yeah, I went to vote for my reviews for my new Aurora and Ida figure uh, um collectibles from my hero at the game. Yeah. So yeah, um so glad to be to be making more of these uh, anime collectible videos. Um not sure um I I do have some more orders, so hopefully they'll be here soon, but besides them I'm not sure when I'll be able to get more, although hopefully like I mean Christmas is kind of approaching really quickly, so hopefully I'll be able to get some more by then. So yeah, and yeah, I do really like being I I'm I do always like being able to make these videos, and yeah, it's just a lot of fun to just talk about all of it to all of you. So, yeah, I went to both of you know, my new Aurora and Ida videos. So, yeah, I want to thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all like this video. If you did, then please like this video. Please comment down below and tell me what you think. Please follow me on Twitter at Daniel Maloney, hey, hey, and Disney. Fan writing Kingdom Hearts and Disney Please every day and please subscribe for more content like this. I'm in here and I'll see you all next time. Take care.